Supporters of Amber Heard protest at the Cannes Film Festival over the inclusion of the Johnny Depp movie. Supporters of Amber Heard are criticizing the Cannes Film Festival for starting with a new Johnny Depp film. The premiere of Jean Dubarry, in which Depp, 59, portrays King Louis XV opposite filmmaker Mon, kicks off the yearly French festival on Tuesday. The actor is anticipated to be present for the red carpet event prior to the screening and the Wednesday morning press conference. Several pro herd fan accounts are using the hashtag hashtag cans you not to express their disapproval of Depp's participation at the important industry event on social media. Earlier this week, journalist Eve Barlow posted a message using the hashtag and added, cans seem proud of their history supporting rapists and abusers, and an infographic that read, if you support Cannes, you support predators and why does Cannes platform predators? Heard sister Whitney liked the post on Instagram. Rebecca, the person behind the Twitter account at Leave Heard Alone, explained to Variety why they are so vocal about Cannes. According to Rebecca, the Dep V. Heard trial served as the platform for the hashtag MeToo movement's global pushback. Hollywood industries appear to be capitalizing on this anger to restore things to as they were. Johnny Depp to open your festival. It feels like a slap in the face, to be honest. The campaign is intended to draw attention to the broader issue of men accused of abuse being protected and insulated by the film industry, they continued. On Monday, Cannes Film Festival's chief Thierry Fremox addressed the decision to have Depp's movie open the festival. He told reporters, according to Variety, I don't know about the image of Johnny Depp in the U.S. To tell you the truth, in my life, I only have one rule, it's the freedom of thinking and the freedom of speech and acting within a legal framework. We wouldn't be here discussing it if Johnny Depp had been prohibited from acting in a movie or if the movie had been banned. We watched Mon's movie, which might have been in a competition. According to Fremox, she would have been the eighth female director. Since everyone was aware that Johnny had produced a film in France, the debate arose as soon as the movie was announced at Cannes. You should ask Mon why she chose him because I have no idea. As for the rest, I'm the last person to be able to discuss all this, he continued. If anyone in the world didn't have the slightest interest in this highly publicized trial, it was me. I have no idea what it's about. They cautioned that the Virginia defamation trial verdict on June 1st might have damaging consequences for further survivors coming forward. Gloria Steinem, Ms. Magazine, Constance Wu, Amy Ziering, the National Women's Law Center, the National Organization for Women, the Women's March Foundation, the Women's Equal Justice Project, and other prominent women all signed it. In a settlement struck in December, Heard agreed to pay Depp $1 million, which he stated would be given to charity. Heard stated at the time in a long statement, I have made no admission. This is not a concession in any way. Moving ahead, there are no limitations or gags on my voice. Following the announcement of the settlement, Depp's attorneys added in their own statement, We are pleased to formally close the door on this painful chapter for Mr. Depp, who made clear throughout this process that his priority was about bringing the truth to light. Fans of Depp have launched social media campaigns against Heard as well. For example, an online petition requesting she be removed from the upcoming Aquaman, and the Lost Kingdom has gained over 4.5 million signatures. She will return as Mira in the sequel out in December and was featured in a teaser trailer showcased at CinemaCon last month.